Good guys, this is some pictures and some clips I took yesterday at Alton Park with my friends John and Josh and it was a great day out to be honest, a fantastic experience, especially with this beauty here. This is my dream car, probably everyone's dream car, a Lamborghini, it was just unreal experience to be sat alongside this to be honest, it was just fantastic. And the mad thing too, it was well out of the way, you got, my friend John spotted it because it was well out of the way, it was like all oh, my days it's a Lamborghini. Um, so yeah, that was unreal. And then this is the McLaren, the orange one. There was a lot, a lot of McLarens and Ferraris, it must be said. Probably about 15 to 20 Ferraris and about 10, maybe 12 McLarens. It was just, I'm, I've never seen so many McLarens and Ferraris in one place. Uh, next up, got the Lamborghini Diablo. This drew the, cloud, uh, the crowds a lot. It's the most expensive one, I think. I could be wrong on that, but I'm sure it is. Uh, and then next up, we've got the Ferrari. Again, like the Lamborghini, this was out the way. As soon as we got there, the first cars we've seen was the Ferraris and the Lamborghini. <laughs> Oh my god, this is some footage of the supercar job. Didn't get that much of it, just a couple. It was a really good race to be honest. The noise, the cars made was just amazing. Then next up we've got the McLaren, probably the best McLaren of the day, I think, the blue one. Orange ones are sexy, but I feel like that one's just a little bit more sexier. Then we've got another Lamborghini. This is the convertible black one. Um, the crowds were a little bit more round with this one, to be honest. There was a coupe one too. Then we've got a Porsche box there. Um, again, convertible. What can you say? Beautiful car. Then the Porsche GT3 RS. Um, that drew a lot of the crowds too. A lot of people were looking at that. Probably most people's favourite Porsche, to be honest. Then we've got the mad, the Lotus. The Lotus is a really weird car. It's brilliant. The, the, they're unbelievable looking cars. You have to stop and take a picture, don't you? Uh, then another Lotus. They've always drew my interest. They're just unreal cars. Then we've got another Lamborghini, a coupe version, the orange. Orange, arguably the, one of the, the most, if not the sexiest colour for a Lamborghini. Uh, that was part right in the middle. Then again, another Ferrari, the black one convertible. Lovely seats. And then, of course, the Bentley. You never, it's mad how thick the Bentley is at the front, so, such a fierce front, it's a, it's a, you know, it's a lovely car, really is, really powerful, then the uh, engine for a Ferrari, so I'm talking a little bit fast, I probably should have extended the clips, so I could have talked a bit longer, but then we've got another McLaren, the blue one, uh, really, really lovely car, really uh, lovely to look at, then again some Lotuses, the Lotuses just stand out like a saw from the unreal to be honest, then a Maserati, there's a few Maseratis actually, and then there's just some more clips, uh, some footage again from yesterday from the supercar show, here we go, we've got overtaking, I think the Lamborghini was going to be for a long time, but we'll see it was caught up right towards the end, uh, but to be honest it was just a noise, it was just really unreal to be honest, it, you could hear it from miles away, it was just, it was, it was unreal you'll see in this, like literally go at the speed you go, I think um, it got to 130 miles an hour, um, I think it's something around that got to, it was around that, uh, obviously can go a lot higher, but yeah that was my day out, it was a fantastic day and I definitely recommend